Has anybody noticed that Lou just contradicted himself or is it just me? Uh, I haven't been, I've been reading a lot of comments online and I have not seen one single ape notice that Lou contradicted himself. Okay, so here's what Lou said before ape was issued. All right, let's talk about it. He said that his plan was he wanted nothing to do with ape. He didn't sign up with ape. Ape was garbage. AMC was going to run. This is what he first said. He said because of the hype around ape. So what what his plan was was for AMC to run up. This is what he said. Then he was going to get out of AMC, sell AMC. He wanted nothing to do with ape. Ape could go out, you know, go after its mother. And he was out of AMC, completely out of AMC. So that's not what happened. Okay. So we all knew AMC was going to cut in half in price, but it went lower. So everything that Lou predicted and said, he said once again, and I want everyone to just listen to me clearly. He said that AMC was going to run with all the hype of Ape. He was completely out of AMC. He wanted nothing to do with Ape. And that's all she wrote. Now, he's saying something else. He's suspended one week on YouTube. Who knows the real reason? He's saying it's because of some video from, from a year ago that he misrepresented um, COVID. I think that's a bunch of BS because it would be something they would have immediately took action on. You know, he's, he's claiming the video was from over a year ago. Now they're taking action on it today and not, not a year ago. No, no, no. Something smells rotten in Denmark worse than something that smells rotten on my, on my throne right now. As you can see, I'm on my throne and I got to get the smell out of here. One second. <sighs> anyway. Uh, is that spray? Okay, hold on a second. Uh, anyway, so now he's saying the complete opposite. The complete opposite. Now he's saying Ape is gonna run. Ape is gonna run for whatever his 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 explanation is. All this you know BS because Ape's gonna cover the synthetics and all this other BS and. And Ape is going to run up to 30, 40, 60, 70 bucks. Now, I want you all to understand he said he wanted nothing to do with Ape. Are you following me? He wanted no nothing to do with it. Now, his plan is he wants nothing to do with Ape Save. And he wants everything to do with Ape to get his money back. Now, that's what he wants. So now he's going to leave. He's going to wait until Ape runs up till 50, 60, 70 bucks. And then he's out of ape, and I don't even know anymore what he's even saying about AMC anymore. The, the guy changes his story so much, it, it's, it, it really is. You feel like you have brain damage. You don't know what to think. He's so inconsistent. He's so all over the place. All right. And for a change, Al from Boston even disagrees with, with Lou. Normally, those two were kind of intertwined. Did you notice that? Like, Al from Boston and Lou, you could pretty much, you know, you could pretty much bet they're going to say the same things. Some some people even suspected, right, that Al from Boston was Lou. There was rumors that Lou started the whole Al, Al from Boston channel. That's why he doesn't show his face. Again, this is alleged. It's not proved. But... It's kind of funny for the first time, even now from Boston disagrees with Lou. I, I, I don't even know what Lou is saying anymore. The guy is so all over the place. One minute, it's like he's for AMC and he's against Ape. Then the next minute, he's for Ape and he's against AMC. Listen, if you can figure out this friggin' brain damage lunatic, could you do me a favor and explain it to me like I'm a six-year-old? Because... <laughs> I can't understand anything this guy's saying anymore. I don't know what he's talking about. I don't think he knows what he's talking about. I think he has brain damage. And I think the people who are listening to this guy have to be even more effed up than he is.